Hi all, Karen Doll here again. We're moving on to something else in another direction. This is The Secret Life of Pets. This is a mini figures playset. Found this one at Toys R Us. We also have an officer review in another video. We bought the Target exclusive one. Those figures are really nice. They're really heavy. But the nice thing with this set is a couple of the figures that are in here were not in the Target set. So that's why we also grabbed this one. Um, if you haven't seen this movie, it's a very cute movie. Loved it. So we're going to flip it over to the back here so we can see. Um, says about the exclusive life, the exclusive life of pets. <laughs> Because I'm reading this and this at the same time. Um, in this pack are the exclusive pets of Mel and Tiberus. Tiberus. I'm trying to remember how his name was. And then you also get Chloe, Max, Snowball, Buddy, Gidget, and Duke. I'm trying to remember who's all in the set from. Because I know you get Duke and Max, Snowball, Gidget, and Chloe. can't remember who else is in the one we got from Target. But like I said, we'll have to do a review of that one. But let's get these guys out of the box. Um... That was a figure my husband liked, Tattoo, the pig. I love the name because I thought it was hysterical, even though I felt bad that the reason why it was tattooed is because he was used to be practiced on at a tattoo parlor. So that was kind of sad. But, oops, ripped the box. No big deal. Didn't know there was more tape on it. So hopefully this won't be too complicated to get out of here. Okay. So move some stuff out of the way here let's see who wants to come off well snowball wants to come off first what do you know <laughs> okay well these guys aren't gummed in or anything let's see uh gidget doesn't want to stand all right okay this is one i'm worried oh no he came out a lot easier than i expected i was worried about him bending as okay he's standing that's the only thing I was worried about getting him out with his body being long. But he actually came out very, very easily. And then there's Duke. I love Duke. Love Duke. And Chloe. Which we, we were laughing because we, our one dog is named Chloe. And for as much as Chloe eats in the movie, that's the way our Chloe is. So it's actually kind of funny. Even though, you know, one's a cat and one's a dog. And we've got Max. Mel, who I actually loved in the movie as well, and Tiberus, Tiberus, whatever his name was. I can't remember. I only watched the movie once. So um, with these guys, they are, um, I don't know what kind of material you would call it. They're not as heavy as the one, the set we got from Toys R Us, and Gidget does not want to stand. So we might have an issue there. Oh, no, there I get, get her to stand. But like I said, part of the reason we got this set was because um, Buddy... Tiberis. I don't remember if Mel was in that set or not, but I know these two for sure were not in that set. Um, Mel was another favorite character of ours, um, the pug. So I'm going to look at each of these guys individually. So you got Max here. Kind of looks like Max from the movie, you know, the white and brown. I can't remember what dog type of dog Max is supposed to be. And he has this blue collar with his little dog bone tag on it. And I mean, he is small. He's a little bit smaller than my pinky so i mean these guys these are small so you know could be a choking hazard for a young child but like i said we got, got it for collector's reasons so and then you have snowball and if you've seen the movie you know he kind of overreacts at times i guess is the best way of putting it um i actually love this character too i thought he was hilarious in it so you kind of have him he's pulling his ears and yelling his eyes are closed and there's his back little cotton tail it was kind of cute at the end though when he got picked up by the little girl and was kind of getting the home and then you come to duke um like i said they kind of have him it looks like he's sitting and pooping <laughs> don't mind me like i said it's been a long week so um duke's all brown and it kind of has his um serious face on it looks like so you guys black nose and then um his collar black collar around his neck and then he has this little tag underneath there so i don't know how well that's picking up and then his tail going on in the back and then chloe i think they capture chloe pretty well because her body her head is kind of small and her body's big which is kind of the way the character was in the movie so you got her ears and she looks like i don't know how well it's picking up on camera it looks like she's smirking a little bit there but they have her stripes and her um grayish white belly underneath so like i said i think they captured these guys pretty good and then mel uh, mel throughout the movie i think had his tongue out more often than not so mel's a pug i do remember that one so
so um, he's got the light brown and then his brown ears and the brown around his muzzle, tongue hanging out, and then his orange collar. And he has his little tag on the bottom. And then they got his little puggy tail going on in the back. And then Tiberon, Tiberon, Tiberus, Tiberon, I'm making up names now and I just knocked the other two over. Um, as you know, it's the Falcon that kind of helps Gidget. You know, that part's funny. If you haven't seen it, you have to see it. So they kind of have him in his position. They got his kind of a little bit of detail here with his feathers in the in on his breast. And then his wings are in the back, which they do have some detailing going with that in the back of the head. And his tail's kind of down here. And then Gidget is a Pomeranian, if you're not if you didn't know that. And they have her pink bow, they have her tongue hanging out, her eyes, and then they kind of have her poofy tail going on here in the back too. So like I said, for basic, for basic, basic, <laughs> basically if they would stand. <laughs> okay, get just, just going to lay down. And then you got Buddy. Like I said, this one with the, the body, I was worried about getting him out. But he has a long dachshund body, the tail, his long nose. He has this little blue collar and tag on. He's really cute. I can't get over how tiny the legs are on a couple of these, though. So like I said, I got, I got this set at Toys R Us. It's about the only place I've seen this one. It doesn't say it's a Toys R Us exclusive, but I can say I haven't, I don't believe we've seen this set anywhere else. So, and I will have to do a review of the Target one. Like I said, um, they are a heavier made. It was also a Target exclusive and everything, but this is a really, really cute set in addition to the set we already have. So that'll be it for this video. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. I'm still trying to reach that magical 500 mark, so help me share my page and reach that so we can do the giveaways on Facebook and Twitter, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!